जय हिंद फ्रेंड्स आज की वीडियो जानेंगे जैसा कि इंडिया टू बिकम ए थर्ड लार्जेस्ट इकोनॉमी बाय 2031 द इंडियन इकोनॉमी इज सेट टू विटनेस अ सिग्निफिकेंट ग्रोथ विद द प्रोजेक्शंस इंडिकेटिंग करता है ए जीडीपी एक्सपेंशन 6.8% इन नेक्स्ट फिजिकल इयर्स दिस ग्रोथ ट्रेजेक्टरी पोजीशंस इन इंडिया टू अटेन कर द अपर मिडिल इनकम स्टेटस बाय 2031 विद द इकोनॉमी एक्सपेक्टेड टू डबल to years to the 7 trillions and said rating agency christine to so, dekhiye by 2031 to hum world ka third largest economy ban chuke hain why does india's outlook reports like christine results the country economic progress will be supported by the domestic structural reform and cyclical factors this crisis anticipate karta hai that india could potentially even surpasses its growth prospect aiming to becoming the world first largest economy by 2050 see what is the project projection kya hai iska a projected average expansion of jaisa ki hum 6.7% hai abhi in this period will make india as third largest economy bana dega in the world and life per capita income to the upper middle income category by 2031 so india with the gdp size abhi isko 3.6 trillion expect the economy to expand karega 6.7 trillion by fiscal year 2021 tak ho jayega so let's friends jaise jaise question kar lete hain consider the following statement given below regarding the marine heat waves it occur when the surface temperature of a particular region of a sea rises to more than 5 degrees celsius above the average temperature for a last 7 days give me the higher ocean temperatures which are associated with mhws can make storms like hurricanes and tropical cyclones stronger high ocean temperatures in the tropical atlantic and caribbean in 2005 led to a massive coral bleaching event Which statement is your correct? I am going to answer first. Only one, only two, only three, and none of the above. So friends, this question you have written. Please try to answer this question. Try to answer this question. Thank you.